To talk more about this particular topic, Nicholas Economides, Professor of Economics from NYU Stern School of Business from New York U, live from San Francisco. And Professor, good to see you on the show again. Uh, last time we talked, we talked a lot about what was happening in, in Europe, and every time we, we hear these unemployment figures, I mean, these are stunning numbers. And I'll ask you the same question. Is the worst over for Greece? I think uh, the worst is over, uh, even though we might still see a couple more of quarters of higher unemployment. But uh, Greece is very close to having a primary surplus, that is a, a budget surplus uh, disregarding uh, interests. Uh, and that probably will happen in the first quarter of 2014. Uh, already, its uh, bonds uh, are doing well. They are not being devalued anymore. People are betting on recovery in financial markets. And I also think that there is a way to increase employment. There is a way to invest in Greece. There are, there are possibilities. It's just that uh, more is needed in terms of political support, and that's why the prime minister of Greece was uh, with Barack Obama today. If, if I'm sitting in Greece and I'm one of the, the statistics of 50 or 60 percent youth unemployment, you know, the, the financial markets are more optimistic, but what about those who are looking for work? What would you tell those? And they say, I can't find a job. What really needs to be done? Well, there, there are different things that you can tell people depending on their skills. Uh, one way to get out of unemployment is to be more entrepreneurial, to try to, find, to do things uh, in an export sector, uh, for example, in the cyberspace, uh, export services, uh, write programs. Do something uh, that, where there is a market outside Greece which doesn't exist uh, in Greece because in Greece everything is shrinking. That's one thing at the personal level. Now, at the macro level, what the government should do is create an, in, an investment program that creates jobs. And they won't be able to absorb the full unemployment, but they will be able to decrease it significantly. And I think one way to do that is to ask the European Union for a grace period in their debt. So for a few years, let's say three to five, not pay the five to six billion uh, euros worth of, of um, uh, interest that uh, Greece normally pays. So take this money and use it in infrastructure projects, invest in infrastructure. And then you would see dramatic reductions in the unemployment rates of unskilled labor. Now that doesn't solve the whole problem because a lot of these unemployed people are skilled. Uh, but skilled people normally would have the opportunity to work somewhere else in the European Pro Union. Professor, before, um, before we got into this crisis with Europe and this, this whole talk about Greece coming out of the Eurozone, I remember the beautiful pictures of tourism, people going to the Greece beaches and all that great stuff. Is it possible that tourism <laughs> could be the silver lining and it might really help Greece pull out of the recession? Tourism uh, is one of the biggest assets of, uh, of Greece. And in fact, this year, because uh, as you know, there has been uh, upheaval in the whole region. Practically, the whole region is unstable except Greece. A lot of tourists have gone to Greece where normally they would have gone to Turkey or Egypt or somewhere else. Uh, and that has worked. That has been clearly beneficial uh, for, for, for Greece. That's the main industry, and it's doing well. So this summer, uh, and the fall are going to be very good for Greece. So that might be a way out. Uh, but more needs to be done in terms of diversification of jobs, in terms of people who are more skilled uh, finding jobs uh, in Greece. The prime minister, of course, was in Washington today meeting the president, uh, President Obama. I, I imagine this isn't going to be his, his, his last big trip. He's going to be traveling most likely around the world, probably talking about the economy a lot and answering a lot of tough questions. Is it possible that a lot of these meetings, he's also discussing with the president how to stimulate the economy and perhaps looking even for, for investment? Yes, absolutely. Uh, the prime minister has been looking for investment, meeting with hedge fund managers in New York, but also uh, the U.S. government has a multitude of ways to help investment. Uh, in a foreign country. For example, they can guarantee loans. Uh, they can provide uh, various ways in which uh, 
which makes uh, the life of businessmen uh, significantly easier and therefore uh, more um, an easy way, an easier way to invest in Greece. So uh, I expect uh, that Mr. Samaras and President Obama have found some very common points in uh, their approach, not just austerity, but austerity together with uh, in investment. And the, the president will find ways to help Mr. Samaras and to help Greece uh, increase the amount of investment and reduce unemployment. All right. Nicholas Economides, professor of economics, NYU, with, uh, with us from San Francisco. Thank you very much. Always insightful. Have a good day.